Hello, folks, and welcome to another episode of Is It Any Good? You may remember recently we did a, uh, a spicy noodle challenge, and uh, if you recall, and if you don't recall, go watch that video. But if you recall, that did not end well for us. It, uh, it destroyed my mouth a number of different ways and pains. So you think, thankfully, I would have learned my lesson from that kind of a nonsense, and let's not do that again. Ho, oh, ho. You'd be wrong thinking that. Nissen's got a hot and spicy Firewalk series of noodles here. This particular flavor is volcanic Mongolian beef. It even comes with a pack of fire sauce. It lets you know you're going to feel the burn. And there's some write-up in there about how it's, I don't know, lovely and delicate and completely fine to, uh, oh, explode with heat. Nope. This is probably not going to end well. Or will it? Uh, there isn't a challenge with that particular one um, with the beef flavor, but I do also have a chicken, a molten chili chicken flavor. Both of these, if you'll see too, they've got six, count them, chili peppers on there. That must mean they're six chili peppers worth of hot. But this one does say, take the challenge, etc., etc., etc. This is hot. You're going to die, the fires of hell and volcanoes and what have you. But today I thought, I'm going to do that Mongolian beef. Volcanic, volcanic Mongolian beef with other natural flavors. So, volcano is considered a natural flavor by the Nissen people. Okay. Uh, well, let's go boil up some water. Let's make these noodles and I'll see you back here. Welcome back. Well, we hit up the microwave for about five minutes or so, which uh, apparently is all it takes to bring a bowl of hot lava to your face. Uh, it came with some dried packets in there like a lot of bowl ramens did, and it came with another uh, sauce packet, the fire sauce. It was about, about this big or so. It's a kiss condom. What? And I put that in there as well. Gave it a good stir. The noodles soaked up a lot of liquid, so kind of like those last uh, last fire noodles that we did, where there wasn't any uh, any liquid in there at all. You drain that off. This one, the noodles pretty much soak up what little liquid you put in there. So all I really got is noodles. And uh, on first smell, they they do smell a little spicy, but not not like what we experienced last time. That was that was an unholy nightmare. Uh, so, again, of course, did we learn? No, 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 no. Uh, so let's do this. Well, I will say, these are spicy. I'm thinking, a lot like the last ones, this is going to start to creep up on me bite after bite. Also, though, these are hot. Heat-wise, I don't know if you can see the steam coming off of these. But these are. These are hot. There is a spice. As with all of this stuff, especially when it gets as hot as it is, spicy-wise, heat-wise, whatever, the Mongolian beef, sure. Really what I've got is just a bag of salt that I put in here and some dried bits of something. And that packet of goo. Overall, though, this, this does have some heat to it. It is spicy. But it's not like what... <coughs> Ooh, maybe I spoke too soon. It's, uh... It's going to reach for some water, but we'll tough it out. We'll power through. Uh, they're not like like those last ones. Like those ones, I, like I said, I could feel it right away. My mouth was sore. It wasn't just burning. It was hurting. These, not so much. There's not a lot of flavor though. And again, I do think that just comes from the wanting to burn you, wanting to just blast your face off and who cares what flavor it's supposed to be? It's Mongolian beef. Sure. Again, sure. It's noodle. 
it's what it is. It's salty pot noodle. There's a lot of noodles in here. You see that? This made a much bigger bowl of noodles than that last one, too. Which, I mean, if you'll remember, again, if you don't remember, go watch the video. Jog your memory. Watch it for the first time. And then come back here. But this is just, this is just hot. This would be like if I were to put like some chili sauce or something in here. As much as this is six chili peppers hot, it's not... <coughs> Ooh, that one caught me again. Uh, it's not... It's not killing me. It's vaguely unpleasant. And again, without a lot of flavor in here, it's just heat that's sort of making its way through. But it's not... It's definitely not killing me. Uh, will I finish this? I think I will. I may go throw some green onions or something on here just to throw a little something fresh. But in all honesty, like I said, this is hot, but this isn't you're going to die hot. We've had worse. Haven't we? All right. Well, as you saw, there's still a lot of noodle in this bowl, uh, which I'm going to go finish. I'll go throw some, dice up some uh, green onions or something on there just to give it something a little cooling, a little fresh. Um, but overall, I mean, was this hot? Yeah. Was it six chili peppers hot? Maybe, uh, depending on how hot those chili peppers are supposed to be. Again, I'm gauging everything based on that last one we did, which was absolutely murderous. And I, again, don't recommend that one to anyone. Um, but this, it is hot. It is spicy. Uh, volcanic? I don't know. I've, I've never tasted volcano. Have you? Tell me in the comments. Uh, but is it any good? Sure. I'll say yeah. Because this is still edible. This is still something you can enjoy. Even if you like some spicy noodles, you like it. Oh, I like it spicy. I like it hot. Then get these. Uh, I've got a hatred for my inner organs. Um, then, you know, try that other stuff. Try something hotter. But as it is, this was good. And, uh, and I'm not regretting it. But that's going to be it for me. I'm going to go finish this bowl off. And I'll see all of you here next time.